the U.S. calculates to strike with organizations related to Chinese airships. The United States is considering action with companies and organizations that aided the Chinese military in conducting a balloon tracking tour in U.S. airspace last week, a senior State Department official said on February. Washington believes the balloon maker has direct ties to the Chinese military, the official said in a statement. White House spokeswoman Karine Jean-Pierre also said Washington would seek to act, but did not say what measures the U.S. government was considering. Jean-Pierre told reporters that the United States would consider broader efforts to expose and counter China's large-scale surveillance activities that pose a threat to the national security of the United States and other countries. Ally The FBI, which is leading the effort to analyze the parts of the downed hot air balloon, said at a news conference that it has obtained only limited evidence and does not yet have enough information to make an assessment. The ability of this object It's still very early for us in this process, as the evidence recovered and turned over to the FBI remains extremely limited, a bureau official said. FBI officials say they have yet to gain access to much of the airship's most important part, where most of the electronics might be, because the part is still under the sea. In a speech to the U.S. Senate Foreign Relations Committee on the same day, U.S. Deputy Secretary of State Wendy Sherman said that the Chinese balloon is another sign that Beijing is trying to reshape the world order. This irresponsible act fully demonstrates what we've known for a long time, China has become tougher at home and stronger abroad, Sherman said during the hearing. Sherman said Washington will continue to prevent China from using American technology to promote military modernization.